This next battle broadcast is brought to you by Mr. Magic Down Under and DiesRemoval.com. I won the die rolls. I'm gonna go first. Solid hand I can keep, especially on the play. So it's gonna be fetching for green and playing the cuddle. Green from the cuddle. Playing the white source, going for Golem Guide and um, Lava Spike. And after that, I have um, Helix make up for my life total. Oh, he's playing blue. Is it twins? Remand. Yes, yeah, probably those twins. You understand the turn. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight damage. Wow. Yeah, he conceded. That's fair enough. Alright, well this is most likely Twins. Um, I have actually a, a brand new Cyborg Plan against Twins. I'm going to try this out. I'm actually going to try to somehow control him. Counting out all my 2 to cast spells, which don't really do much. Hmm. I'm not that huge of a fan of um Path to Exile to be honest. Alright, so what do I want to play with here? I like the idea of playing commands because it lets me hit through his core fire his um spell kites, but I think Searing Blades does a better job. So I'll just go with Searing yeah, yeah, I'll keep the Searing Blades instead. I'd like to keep all my sor sorcery speed spells, to be honest, and probably path. Hmm. I'll probably go with the helixes over two rift bolts. No, one searing blaze and one rift bolt. I don't really want to draw too many searing blazes. Ah, nah, screw it. I'll go with the whole lot. Here we go. If this works out, this will be a really interesting cyborg strategy. Oh, I need two white sources here. What the? I mislabeled, I mislabeled him, he's playing Jeskai. Unit end of turn. Alright, he's playing Jeskai, not twins. But he's also playing Remand for some reason. Um, what do you take? Not the Searing Blaze, because I'm not playing actually an aggressive deck, so it's one of these ones. Is it either going to be the Edelon or the, um... Swiss Spear? I don't think he kept a Core Firewalker in this matchup. Oh wow, he's playing four colors. Black, white, red, blue.
His best choice really is between um, Swiss Bay and, and um, Eidolon. I think he can easily deal with Nikado. And um, Goblin Guide is not much of a threat, it actually helps him out a bit too. Yeah, I believe that's the right choice. Did not draw land, sadly. For blue, Snapcaster um, Inquisition, most likely. Yeah. This time taking away probably the Swiss Bear. All the answer in place. I'll probably take the second place, it's the biggest risk there. Interesting. So he gambled me not drawing a land, and he made the right choice. Which is a shame for me. It's got another Snapcaster Mage. He just took it for some reason. So he's got three cards in hand, one of them is Snapcaster. So another land in hand plus Snapcaster. He's gonna block the Golden Guide for sure. Let's just try for it. Now he knows I have multiple core firewalkers in hand, so he's probably gonna hold up back his snapcaster so we can use that to um, recast spells in there. He's on four. He's on three. He's got um one snapcaster in hand. Oh no, he took your the snapcaster. He won't draw it anymore. No no no, he still has it. No, sorry, my bad. He's got one snapcaster in hand. He just drew two cards and I don't know what he has anymore. Okay, so out of the four cards, one of them is Snapcaster, three of them is unknown.
that pasta. Lava Spike, do you have a counter spell? He does not. GG.